What class do you have? Jazz history. <laughs> what is that? We're entering the campus right now. Oh. It says no filming. <laughs> Let's go in. Do you not get social anxiety here? Do you have any motivation? No. <laughs> Hi, Stan Stans! My name is Stan. Welcome to the world of Extra. And my name is Sui. <laughs> we are back! Today, we are dressed like little schoolboys. I released a new collection. It's the cow collection, this tote bag. It says, buy extra. It has one, two, three, four pockets and the big one. And it has a little button right here. You know, I love journaling so much. And my favorite journal recently is, of course, my own buy extra cow journal. Available now at buyextra.com. It is hardbound. Anyway, a lot of you guys have been curious about Stubby's day in the life when he has school since this video came out a few weeks ago. So today we are going to see his, you know, school life, his actual daily life. Hey you, come here and sign this contract. <laughs> come, come here and tame this animal. <laughs> hey you, come over here and catch this fish. <laughs> Let's go! Okay, so when I was in university, half of my entire university career was basically online because of cockroach nights. And now that you have to commute, the trains are really busy. How do you feel about that? Do you like it online or do you like it IRL? I liked it online because I got used to that because like that's how my uni life started. And then they were like, okay, everything's in person. I'm going, oh, true, true, true. Yeah. And I can't wake up because like... That's your pitch, I wake you up. The trains are actually really busy now, especially because the borders opened last October. Everyone's like back to their face-to-face -face life yeah. or work and school and everything, so. But also I think everything being face-to-face -face is good because I can meet new people. That's true, I love meeting new people. And all my friends in university, I made actually in the first two years of uni because the later half of my university career, it was all online. I was not able to make a single friend. And you're making a lot of friends actually. I am. Yeah. So we're entering the campus right now. Oh, what the hell is this? This is not safe. Safe? Thank you so much to Surfshark for sponsoring this video. As you guys know, Surfshark is an app or browser extension that allows you to place your device anywhere in the world as, as if, if you were in, in that, that location. location. This can do a lot of things for you. With Surfshark, you can unblock websites and content that are not available in your own location. I know a lot of you guys want to move to Japan, but while you're still in your country, you can watch your favorite anime that are not available in your country. Surfshark encrypts your online data and protects your browsing history to make sure your personal information is not stolen. Damn, this bike has Surfshark. <laughs> With Surfshark, you can also hide your IP address to make sure you're not being tracked. Aren't you just so filthy rich that you have so many gadgets? Well, with Surfshark, you only need one account to protect all your devices. But yeah, you can enjoy all these amazing features plus more with three extra months free by using my code EXTRA. There's also a 30-day money-back guarantee if you have issues with commitment. So, there is no risk to trying it out for yourself. Click, Click the link in the description box, box and thank you so much to Surfshark for sponsoring this video. So, we have made it to Waseda University. And if you guys didn't know, Waseda University is the number one private university in Japan. And it just so happens that I go here. And if you guys didn't know, I graduated from Waseda University as well. And you ended up being a YouTuber. Exactly. But yeah, we made it to school and Stevie has to go to his first class of the day. He actually only has like one class. What class do you have? Jazz history. <laughs> what is that? I swear, Wasana has the most random classes. I love it. <laughs> I know, Wasana has the most random classes, and we just take them for the credits. Oh, wait, I don't <laughs> say that. But no, he's gonna take jazz history. I love jazz. Especially Lady Gaga's Love for Sale. Stream now. Oh. Good luck, Sweet. I'll, I'll see you see later. later. So we want to make this video as unfiltered as possible. We really want to show like the real behind the scenes in Stewie's university life. So let's just be real, Stewie skipped first period. <laughs> And he didn't make it to class, so now we're on our way to get lunch. Where do you usually go for lunch? I grab food at Family Mart because of points. Oh, because you love getting the Rakuten points. Yeah. <laughs> he only goes to Family Mart. He doesn't go to any other convenience store because he wants the points. If you guys have seen my past university vlogs, you guys know that we have convenience stores everywhere in the university. It says no filming. <laughs> let's go in. <laughs> Stewie, what do you usually get? Stewie likes to be on a budget. So let's see what Stewie picks out. There's a lot of bentos. This Family Mart is in a university so they have a lot of bentos. I used to get some of these when I was here. I come into this family mart and what I get is the tsunami mayo. 
and that's the lunch. Or if I'm feeling a little bougie, I'll go over here and take, I think, this one. Really? Yeah, like just this. Do you not get a drink? Tap water from home. Okay, let's see what I should get. First of all, I saw this hack online, so I'm going to get the chicken and waffle thing. Okay. My favorite onigiri is mentaiko. I also talked about this on Instagram, but I'm gonna get this salty little bitch. Every time I'm thirsty as fuck, it literally quenches my thirst like no other. Uh -huh. Okay, after you get your food from Family Mart, where do you eat? I eat at the lounge. The lounge. I've never eaten at the lounge before. This is the lounge. It's the lounge. <laughs> Do you not get social anxiety here? I used to, but like, if I eat with friends, I don't. Okay, so you never eat here alone. Yeah. Okay, now we need to like find a spot in front of people. <laughs> okay, so we have found this little round table. So it's time to eat. We actually haven't had breakfast. What time is it? 2.25 p.m. Stewie's first class was 10 a.m. 10.40. And what time did we wake up? One. <laughs> Oh. While we're eating, we're also gonna answer some questions from Instagram. We actually got so much fucking food. This yeah. is kind of insane. We're gonna do a whole university mukbang. <laughs> Wait, I didn't mean to get this much. Thank you. Mine. Bitch, you, you have go. the nerve. I was like, oh, I'm gonna pay. And then he just started getting things and putting it in the basket. You're supposed to live your actual university life. What is this? Wait, but if I were alone, I had to buy it myself. Um... <laughs> there we go. <laughs> First of all, Questions from the stand stands. Motivations during exam? None, bitch. Do you see me studying? You know the thing is, it's midterms week next week. And he's like skipping class this week. I'm pretty sure this week the professors were supposed to give instructions for the exam. Can I skip like three classes? <laughs> this week. It's so bad. Hi, y'all. <laughs> Do you have any motivation? No. <laughs> Wait, no, but like, if I wanted motivation, I just like dance to I Am by I Am. Every time he studies at home, he just starts dancing, and I'm like, can you shut the fuck up? Mmm, time to How is Jimmy's love life? <gasps> non existent. <laughs> I'm not looking for a relationship, I just want fuck. Love life? I barely even love life. <laughs> Just kidding. So yeah, he's not looking for love. He just wants to act on his gay impulses. Did you kind of eat? But I've been so boy crazy recently. I feel like, like I see someone hot and I'm like, ooh, I would. I think it's getting a little bit toxic. Yeah. And a lot of people mistook like his tea about this guy as his boyfriend. He never had a boyfriend. This guy that he was talking about was like a one-time thing that he ended up falling in love with because it was his first. He got feelings. Yeah. Oh, here's the tea, y'all. I blocked him everywhere. Like on all accounts, like all accounts. <laughs> you have a hoe account. I have a hoe account. <laughs> but also, I think the reason why I fell for this guy like too hard was because I never had like male attention growing up. You know how like in high school, like for straight people, they're always like they can get girlfriends, boyfriends, whatever. So I think I craved that, and then I finally got some attention from someone, and then he made it like so magical, or whatever. So I was like. Oh yeah, it was like your first time having attention from a boy you actually found really hot and attractive and you had sex with. And he like... <laughs> and he seemed like he reciprocated like... That's true, but the tea is, Stewie's 19 and the guy he hooked up with was 23. So of course there's like an imbalance of experience, an imbalance of security I think. True, true, true. I overthought a lot of things about it, so that's why I decided to block it. Anyway, this is the little hack I saw online, and I'm sure you guys have seen it as well. It's been going on everywhere. So first you get the maple and margarine pancake, and I just put the little chicken and sandwich that bitch. Sandwich it. Ooh. <laughs> is it good? Mmm. Do you have any plans or goals for the future? I'm not like entirely sure yet. I haven't planned it out completely yet. So the answer is no. <laughs> Just know I want to like do dance professionally. Oh, you want dance as your profession, as your full-time profession. <gasps> and my dream, ooh. Like if I achieve this dream, I can die. If I'm able to dance with Lady Gaga on stage <laughs> as her dancer. Lady Gaga's backup dancer. I think that's a really good dream. And I think it's so achievable, especially you because you're really talented. <gasps> Thank you. Yeah. And uh, Stewie's actually been doing a lot of dance, mm. and he actually has a dance performance in two days in Shibuya. I have to practice the choreography. Yeah. When did Stewie know he's into guys? Ooh, that's a really good question. I really don't know. What comes to mind is, ooh, I've never told you this before, I think. Really? Wow. Yeah. We were in our house, and it was like nighttime, and then you and Mama were like upstairs already, like starting to sleep and I was downstairs using the computer and then I pulled up this clip of like of like an animation of a, like a woman sucking a guy's 
And then I wasn't looking at the woman, so. And then Animation? I was like, yeah. What did you search? I don't know, it just came up and I just clicked it and I was like, oh. <laughs> of course, like since before, I would have like crushes on guys, but I actually realized that it was like exclusively guys when I would watch PORN when I was in fifth grade and I was only looking at the guy as well. And then I was like, what if I put the words gay and PORN together? And then that was the jackpot. I found the gold mine. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we're just gonna continue eating and let's move on to the next activity. Okay, we just had lunch. So what do you do after lunch? Maybe since I have like the dance performance like tomorrow or the day after, I'm probably gonna just practice dancing. Oh, so you just like randomly practice dancing? Yeah. That's cool. Where do you practice dancing? Just outside, like over there. There's like a little spot. Wow, confident. Okay, take me there. <laughs> okay. So we have made it to this big open space and apparently Stewie just practices dance here. There's literally no one. This is so cool. I know that the bookstore is right there. That's where we used to get all our books. I mean, I get all my books on Facebook Marketplace because it's so much cheaper. <laughs> anyway, okay, Stewie, do your thing. So Stewie would just find like a random classroom to study. Today he didn't really bring anything, but he has a Korean test coming up next week. So show us what you know in Korean. And I'll just do my own thing over here. <laughs> <laughs> so is this right? Wait, I need to check. Yes, Pang is room. Wow, he's speaking it, you guys. He's Koreaning. <laughs> what is in the room? <gasps> Yeah. The classrooms here in Waseda are so nice. As you can see, this is one of like the basic classrooms. It's actually really big. There's like smaller ones, of course. There's also really big like arena classes. Is that what you call them? Waseda is a really nice university, I think. A lot of people ask me if they should come here. You honestly should. It is kind of pricey, but if you get a scholarship, Welcome! Would you recommend people to study in Japan? I don't know, do whatever you want. <laughs> I don't think it's any different from studying in other countries. Like, this bitch doesn't know what he's talking about. I would recommend you guys to study in Japan if you guys don't want to take universities seriously. Oh. Honestly, like, it's really easy. Like, Japanese universities are known to be really easy. Like, the admission process might be a little bit hard. There's a lot of requirements. But once you get in, it's like, child's play. <laughs> Come I mean, to, look at him. Come to Waseda Sills. And the fact that you can like opt out of certain classes and like- You could apply for like exemption. Yeah, you can like, what the fuck is this bullshit? It's like, oh, these are the requirements and you can be like, actually, I don't want to take it. They're like, okay, you don't have to. <laughs> what? So this lunch. is what Stewie does after lunch, like go dancing and then go Before study. Work. So after this, you're going to go to work? Yeah. Okay, I guess let's go. So, as you guys can see, a lot of people have finished school already. It's currently 5 p.m. Some people finish school at like 6 something, you know, past 6, but those are the students who hate themselves. <laughs> I mean, like, why would you take classes past 6? Anyway, we're on our way to Okuma Garden House, which is like a little garden here. Stewie loves to chill there before work. He says it closes in like 3 minutes, so... Good luck to us! <laughs> this is the iconic... What is it? Not me being a Waseda student and not knowing. <laughs> not me being an alumni and not knowing. <laughs> I honestly don't even know the school hymn. I just know it goes Waseda, 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 Waseda. That's it. I don't know anything else. <laughs> Wait, I've been here like millions of times during my university era. <laughs> Ready? Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> So, we have made it to Cafe Cotton Club, and this restaurant is actually one of my favorites ever. Back in the day, I would take my grinder and Tinder dates here because it was really affordable for university students. Wait, it is? Yeah. They used to have this lunch set that was 1,000 yen, which is like $9. For free food, unlimited drinks, your choice of pasta, free upsize, free dessert, and free salad. All for $9. Let's get in there. <laughs> we are gonna go for a quick little pick-me-up. Let's fucking go. 
So we got ourselves a mocktail. This is no alcohol piña colada. Cheers. Cheers. I just wanted to treat Stewie to a nice little relaxation before work. Thank you. Mmm. Mmm. It's yummy, huh? I honestly love the vibe of this restaurant. Look at it. So first things first, we got ahijo. What is that again? I don't know, but mom makes it at home. Welcome ahijo. Okay, a little taste test. It comes with this little bread. Oh, it's like scallops. Is it like shell? Oh, apple tea. Ah. <laughs> Fuck. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> it comes with little baby shrimps. Look yummy. That's even hotter, fuck. <laughs> Ew, you spat it out. Oh, it was so good. <laughs> it's so yummy, huh? It's so yummy, but it's so hot. Fuck, out. Next thing on the list, fried zucchini. I've actually never had any of these things from this restaurant, even though I've literally come here probably like five million times. But I honestly just wanted to try out new things. So let's try it. Bon appetit. Mmm. Mmm. That's yummy, huh? Mm. We also got some fried squid. Let's try her. Okay, you try it first. You try it first. Okay, is it hot? Probably. I think it is. Mmm. Honestly, I'm just gonna get fucked up drunk. More <laughs> alcohol for me. I love this life. <laughs> What was that? What was that? <laughs> <laughs> we got a little bit carried away. I had a little bit too many cocktails, so we ended up just like going to karaoke and going to arcade, and now it's like 9 p.m. I've been having so much fun today. <laughs> but this is the Wasura Circle in Takada no Baba. That is Big Box. But basically, like, this is where all the people, all the Wasura students get fucked up drunk in the weekends. But Stewie has to go to work now, yeah. or at least pretend to go to work. Hi, you guys. We bumped into one of my besties. This is Chica. Hi, I'm Chica. <laughs> <laughs> See, I told you this circle is where all the Waseda students get yeah, fucked up. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, if you're here on a weekday, it's kind of pathetic. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Stewie, I'll see you later. You have see to go to you. work. Good luck at work. Thank you. Lemon, lemon, lemon. lemon. Where's the lemon? Okay, bye. Okay, bye. Time to use my Buy Extra Couch Journal from BuyExtra.com. It's so cute. <gasps> All my students here. Come in. Uh... Come in. <laughs> <laughs> we are just gonna reenact what he does for his English teaching job. Can you pronounce these words for me? Manhattan. <gasps> okay, time for lesson two. Can you read this? <laughs> Mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. Okay, time's up. We seem to have reached the end time of today's lesson. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> that was such a good productive day. It was so good. It was so fun. Thank you for of course. taking course. Stubia usually comes home at around 10.30 p.m. because he finishes work at 10. Yeah. He usually works from like 6 or 7 until like 10. He has like four students usually. One student is like 50 minutes. Yes. Anyway, if you guys have any video requests or suggestions, please let us know in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys again on my next video next, next week. week. Bye! Bye.